Hey there, it's Carl Eisenberg at Eisenberg Residential and we are here for our agent spotlight with Ashley Stone. And we have been so thankful to have Ashley. And Ashley, you've been with us, gosh, when did you join the team? Uh, so we started with you in March. So in March. almost a year. Wow, but, and when, you, when did you get your license? I got my license um, early January. Okay, mm -hmm. so it, you haven't even been a licensed realtor for a full year yet, have you? Not yet, no. And you were just hitting the ball. You're doing great out there. Thanks. And are you, you had, you know, it took a while to get moving, but mm -hmm. you're certainly busy now. Yeah. I mean, you've got several closings and things are going well. So, um, so that's how long you've been in the business. And tell us a little bit about what, where'd you come from? Like, what did you do before real estate? And what, you know, what took you into getting into this industry? Yeah, so my whole uh, professional background as an adult is was in medical. So I was a medical assistant um, and then a scribe for an orthopedic surgeon. I didn't know this. Yeah. So the next time I fall down and get hurt, I, I can yeah. call you yeah, instead of... Yeah, like a doctor. Wow. <laughs> you don't even have to go look for Halloween costumes because yeah. you have them in your closet. Have scrubs. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, so I just, um, once the pandemic hit, we kind of had issues with coverage, so I wanted something a little more flexible. Okay. So I actually quit to stay home with our daughter and okay. uh, went back to school for my real estate license. Fantastic. Yeah, so I love real estate, I love interior design, so that's my goal one day is to tie it in together. Well, our people need that. They need that guidance. Have you found that when you're going out and you're you know, meeting with clients that, that having that interior design background has helped you? Um, yeah, it's definitely helpful, especially in some homes, helping people see past the ugly, as I say, right. <laughs> and potential <laughs> hidden behind some walls. So it's always good to have that eye. That's awesome. So with the fact that you, you first off, it's been a tumultuous and full of life Mm -hmm. 10 months, yeah. right? And good for you, lucky for you that you've been able to experience a correction in the market. Mm -hmm. Who would want to have a boring life where it just keeps going like crazy? <laughs> right. But you've seen how hard it was to get buyers under, and now it's like, wow, how do I sell this listing? So you've mm -hmm. seen a little bit of both sides of it. Yeah. Uh, of all the things that you've seen, what do you think is, um, what's the most fun? What do you like the best about it? Um, I guess I love just mingling with the buyers and getting to know them and the sellers, getting to know everybody a little bit of their backstory and then walking them through the process because it's so emotional and I feel like emotions run high and we're kind of like a, a therapist to them in a sense. That's true. That's <laughs> so it's true. nice to just have that bond. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. And when you finally get them into their new home mm -hmm. and they had a wonderful feeling, isn't it? Right, it is. Exactly. So as you look to this coming year, I mean, um, we're very thankful to have you on the team. You're an important part of our business. You're a fantastic partner. So thank you for being with us. That's why we're doing this Agent Spotlight. Mm -hmm. But as you look to helping your clients next year, what is the, if, if you could choose one thing to talk to your clients about, because you, you know, you're, it's not like you're bored, like you've been doing this forever, and then you're surprised, oh my gosh, the market's changed. You have the unique, um, advantage of mm -hmm. coming into the, the business when it was crazy hot, mm -hmm. seeing it correct and change. You've adapted and you're helping, you're selling inventory now when a lot of people aren't, mm -hmm. okay? So if there's one thing you could say to your, your people, your clients, your friends, mm -hmm. um, about how to think about the future, because we hear people that are fearful, people that are, you know, you know they, they think the world's gonna go this way or it's gonna go that way. You know, what is your perspective on the next, as, as someone newer in the industry, mm -hmm. how do you, where do you see this business? What is it you'd like to share with your, with your database? Yeah, I think, um just being as part of our team and being powered by place, just learning how to help others build wealth through real estate and also right. learning those things myself. It's just right. really exciting if we can help them set themselves up for success down the road. That would be my biggest goal for next year. Uh, I agree. You know, that's, you know, the wealth is really built in a, in a down market or mm -hmm. a changing market. It's not, and it's, it's, we've had a lot of people that are like, oh my gosh, things are crazy. But when we look at all the numbers, we realize it's not really, it's just a, it's a correction. Next six months are mm -hmm. going to be interesting. Right. 
but there's a lot of opportunity out there, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I agree. Well, I think your clients are lucky to have you for that opportunity, and we really appreciate you, and really appreciate you being a part of the team. Thank you, I appreciate you all too. Well, I just want to thank you for joining us for our Agent Spotlight. Uh, having our agents here is our way of showing how important our agents are, our partners, because we really are a collaboration of partners, and we all work well together, and Ashley, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you doing this, and welcome to the team, and welcome to 2023. Well, thank you. I love being part of the team. Thank you for having me today. Absolutely. Fun. All right. Have a fantastic December, and Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays.